I'd really love to see that launch, but also got better weather than we've been seeing recently for today. Now, checking out those conditions in San Luis Obispo right now from our KSBY cam. Got a little bit of that fog sticking around. It's easy to see here on this camera, but it's not actually making its way all the way down to the surface along most of the central coast. So it's keeping us cooler, but not decreasing our visibilities too much. You can see it's keeping that cloud cover just a little bit farther off the ground this morning. Still something to keep an eye on, though. If you're on those roadways this morning, you could see some limited visibilities here and there. Other than that, no major concerns. Our biggest weather maker though is on its way. So right now we've got that big ridge of high pressure sitting over us here on the central coast, kind of pushing the large area of that monsoon moisture that's really continuing to form in that same area it has days and days uh, on end and that's into southern Arizona and northern Mexico. We are continuing to see that make its way a little bit closer to here, but that blocking ridge is going to move its way out of the way and that's going to start to let a lot more of that onshore breeze in some more of that marine influence into those interior valleys and that's going to cool them down pretty significantly though. So big changes are on the way. We are almost done with that extreme heat. We're also seeing a little bit more of that marine influence today. Anywhere that we are seeing that it's going to be even a little bit cooler for today, but overall patchy at best seeing just a little bit of that medium level cloud cover still sticking around through these next couple of hours. You can see a little bit of that fog sticking around in the San Luis Obispo area, but clearer than we've been seeing recently. So good news there. No major concerns for your drive this morning. If you're headed out to the Mid-State Fair today, though, you're going to want that water bottle. It is going to be hot out there. 105 degrees by 3 p.m. You can see those carnival rides opening around noon, and that's when it's going to be a little bit more comfortable. Still in the 90s at that new time hour, getting into the triple digits, staying there until the evening, then cooling down just in time for some of those evening concerts. It's going to feel much more comfortable then. Still very warm, though, for the start of those days. So checking out the forecast elsewhere along the Central Coast, 82 degrees in San Luis Obispo for today, 73 in Santa Maria, 72 in Lompoc, and 77 degrees in Santa Barbara for today. Along our North Coast, not too bad. 99 degrees in Atascadero, 62 in Cayucas, 81 degrees in Avila Beach in the Five Cities region. Similar comfortable conditions there as well. 80 degrees in Napomo, 65 in Los Osos, 103 degrees in Shandon and along our south coast. More of those coolest conditions along our south coast, 76 in Goleta, 98 degrees in the Coyama Valley and 85 degrees in Los Alamos. Now over the next few days, we're going to be seeing similar conditions across the entirety of the central coast, cooling down a little bit as we head into the middle of next week, especially in those interior valleys staying significantly cooler Sunday, Monday into Tuesday, but then by Wednesday, Thursday and Friday, especially for the California Mid-State Fair, it is going to get hot once again, getting back into the triple digits, even possibly all the way up to 110 degrees by Sunday. Neil, back to you. All right, Vivian, thank you.